Shoes etiquettes? What are they? Do they even exist? Questions like these do arise in people's mind. So yes, this is one of the legit etiquettes. Shoe etiquettes. Hi everyone, this is me Mokshi Gambhir and I welcome you all to Quick Wits. This video is regarding the shoe etiquettes or the etiquettes one should follow with which pair of shoes to wear with which kind of outfit, and which color of shoes and how to sit wearing the shoes. Without any further ado, let's start the video. So shoe etiquette is actually a thing. What kind of shoes to wear in what kind of occasion? If you're going to a formal party, so always prefer to wear dark colored shoes which match your dress color and most importantly they shouldn't be too funky or too bright they should be subtle and so the algorithm goes like more dark is more formal less dark is less formal so for any formal event you can go for black you can go for brown so in formal parties or in formal places we should always wear the shoes of closed toe because it's always considered no part of our foot should be visible while going for a formal place or in a formal party so no skin show foot is considered decent in formal wears less skin show of the foot is equals to more formal next is for females who prefer to wear heels so if you're going for an informal or formal functions but in a daytime then you should always prefer heels of less than 10 inches you can wear heels of 3 to 7 inches as per your comfort but they should be less than 10 inches prefer so heels are usually made for the night parties and functions so you can wear heels uh, up to 10 inches and more in the night comfortably that's totally fine next is should we remove our shoes outside the house if we go to somebody else's place so if you don't know or you're stuck what to do then you should definitely follow the host if the host has removed the shoes then you should also remove the shoes if the host hasn't removed his or her shoes so one thing is you can either follow the host whatever the host is doing if they have removed their shoes so you can also remove that shoes if they haven't removed their shoes so there are two things that you can do first one is either you can follow the host completely that you also don't remove your shoes second thing is you can ask the host if it's required to remove the shoes out or not because some people do take this rule very strictly because the sole of the shoes is quite dirty and, and they consider it impolite and rude if you're taking that dirty shoes inside somebody's house. Next is if you're wearing the shoes, so it is always considered culturally and morally wrong to sit while crossing your legs, your ankle over the other knee the sole of your shoe will be showing to the other person and it might be dirty as well so it can create a really bad impression of yours and secondly it can spoil the mood of the person sitting in front of you so it is always considered impolite to cross your legs and show the sole of your shoes to the other person now is what kind of shoes can we wear to a hotel or a restaurant so if you're going to a basic hotel or a basic restaurant so you can wear depending upon the crowd you can go for either formal or informal but if you are going to a michelin star restaurant then ignore the basic and definitely go for the formal dress because the crowd there is quite formal every guest there usually wear the formal clothes so if you'll go wearing the informal clothes in a michelin star restaurant then you'll find yourself odd for now so it's always preferable to wear formals when you're going to michelin star restaurant so these were various do's and don'ts regarding the shoe etiquette. If you like these and learn something new from this video, then do like, share, comment and please subscribe to our channel quick quits. Thank you. Stay tuned. Bye-bye.